Hello everyone, uh, I just want to make a quick video on my experience with uh, the laptop repair. Uh, I've been using this uh, Asus laptop, gaming laptop, which I bought from Best Buy on 2019, where, you know, when we landed in Canada. Uh, I was not having any laptop or desktop or anything to work on it. So I just went there and quickly purchased uh, one of the top end high-end uh, uh, laptop what they had in the store uh, but unfortunately they did not have one thing to sell they just had one display piece so they asked me to uh, purchase online so they helped me to do that on the store and then I purchased uh, one of the laptop uh, very high-end uh, that has uh, all the bells and whistles <laughs> at that time 2019 uh, around I think around May or June I think I bought this one and it was like almost around like three thousand two hundred dollars, which includes tax and of course everything. Yeah, I like like this laptop, but too much. Uh, I used to do all my activities like uh, gaming and you know some kind of my personal work, and it, that uh, helped me a lot for applying jobs and stuff like that. And I used it for one year. Uh, let me show you my lab. This is the one. So uh, I used it for almost a year, uh, and then. All of a sudden, uh, after one year, it, it stopped charging first, you know, uh, so I thought like this. And uh, I tried to change this cord, uh, it did not help me at all. Then I knew something is wrong in my laptop, but I always get scared of opening it and, you know, wa voiding, uh, voiding the warranty and stuff like that. Uh, it is pretty much easier to open. Uh, it's not too tough, uh, but there are a bunch of screws you need to open and there will be a hidden screw inside this uh, gripper here. Uh, but yeah, but I was so scared. Then I thought of uh, giving it to Best Buy. To my bad luck, uh, I was run out of uh, warranty just like four or five days. Uh, then they sent it to uh, ASUS uh, Center for the repair and diagnostic. They come back and told me, I put it on the water. I was like, what? I don't put it on the water, actually. Uh, but they, they did told me that it's uh, gone into the water and, and my entire motherboard is gone. And uh, they asked me that it will charge them $2,000, $2,200 to change it. And it was the beginning of the COVID season and uh, they said like it's a shortage and it will take some time. But it will cost me $2,000, Canadian dollars, you know. The entire lap laptop cost me like $3,000 with tax. Uh, spending $2,000 for repair and stuff like that, I was like not confident at all. I told them, no, no, I cannot afford to do that now. So I kept it. And it's been long, long days, like for us. It was just sitting down there and everything. And during that time, we had some flood in our basement and and this went into that flood as well you know a lot of water went inside it's i'm not going to do anything with that i have to just rip apart and take the some parts and keep it for my future use for something i was too much worried about my hard drive which is inside and a lot of you know like family memories are there like i was so scared but then i started googling around and uh, find some repair shops here I, i'm talking about after two years you know <laughs> So now 2022 now and uh, I found a shop which, had, which has a lot of reviews on them like the shop name is uh, Duck Toes uh, so I thought like okay let me go and check them. So I went there and gave them this laptop for the repair. They say like we don't know what is the problem but we'll diagnose and come back to you with the problem what is it and everything and seek your permission to repair it you know. I said yeah there's nothing wrong to give a shot they say like it will charge you like two hundred dollars you know like if, if it spends two hours or something like that to diagnose so yeah this is the last try i'm going to give a shot uh, i'm going to lose two hundred dollar actually right because if they come back and say the same story like you know you have to replace the motherboard and stuff like that it's kind of thing right but yesterday i received a call from them saying that it's a good news your laptop is ready and there's a small problem in your uh, motherboard just just some capacitor or something 
and uh, they did not charge me. It's free. It's like mm, that's good news actually. After two years, I lost my hope all the way. You know, I have this my running laptop. It's my gaming. That's my son. I'm just swing that something here. Oh, forgot my password. What? Yeah, now it's working. Oh my God, these guys are my life savior. It's in very good condition. Nothing wrong with it. They say like it's all good to go. I don't know how can I can express that. Like I lost a hope on this, but they made it. You know, th th this is the company uh, which is in Calgary, actually in Canada. It's one of the best. I I never seen something like that. They have repaired it and they, you know, saved my laptop to be, you know, gone in the junkyard, you know, you, you, you get what I mean? And uh, I get my life back. I'm so happy. I'm so glad they did that. And this is the company details, you know, I'll put it on the description as well. Ductos, very good. I'll be writing a very good review about them. Uh, but yeah, this is a very high-end laptop. As you can see that it has a... 3 milliseconds refresh rate which is good for uh, first person shooter games stuff like that it has all the RGB and and it comes with uh, GeForce uh, 2070 I'm talking about 3 years back guys this was the high end laptop and it has a camera down here which is good for the streamers so that you can see the face all together and everything yeah it's working I cannot thank enough to Productos for this absolutely amazing they have fixed it they have uh, cleaned it they have given me one month warranty for this if something goes back again they can fix it back again so yeah that's that's a quick review about my uh, you know, laptop the issues I had and I got it back uh, like my content and thanks for watching and please like comment and subscribe thank you see you guys bye